University of Ghana Medical Center. There was a whole listen about it. We've managed to solve the challenges. I was here, some misquoted me, several things. It looks like I was fighting what I should even have did. Luckily for us, that place is now operationalized. We said that phase two money is supposed to do what phase one should do. We have moved ourselves. Just about last three weeks, we started assessing funds and money for medicines and clothing and linens to operationalize the wards are all in now. As I speak, we have got financial clearance for 2,000 health professionals and they are already recruiting. I think some adverts were in the papers not long ago. But we and the Nintendo Management Committee have planned to operationalize on phased basis so that we don't create any chaotic situation in that huge hospital where you are trying to operate or operationalize all the divisions at the same time. So we are doing what we call phased operationalization. We now have the limited OPD and we are doing the uh, mother and child facility fully opened. But if you fall ill tomorrow morning and you are there, we will not send you to any other hospital. Unfortunately, and I think I have to mention it, when the minority caucus on the health committee decided to go and do what they were trying to do, I will not call it mischief. God works like anything. He saved us. One of them fell ill and we could give him a bed there for a doctor to see him. So when they were talking about banding projects, they have spared me the agony of the University of Ghana Medical Center now.